Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do a, another Twin Flame update reading for you guys. Sorry for the wet look, I just got out of the shower. <laughs> okay, so let's see right away what's going on. I'm going to pull out a Journey of Love Oracle card just to start us off and see what's going on. For you guys, full moon today, June 5th. Full moon and lunar eclipse. Full moon, lunar eclipse. Full lunar eclipse. <laughs> okay. Let's see what's going on with planets in retrograde right now. I don't know which one. I think it's Saturn or Mercury, which is in retrograde. I don't know, you guys. I, I knew and now I don't know. Anyway, let's see what's going on. Messages for the Collective Twin Flame Soulmate. Love reading. If you guys want a personal reading with me, my Gmail address is down in the description box, as well as my Amazon wish list if you feel like buying me a deck. <laughs> if you buy me a deck of cards, I do you a personal reading, and I use it, of course. Thanks so much for those of you who do send donations to my channel. It's very generous of you, and it helps my channel a lot. And thank you for subscribing as well and clicking on the little bell for notifications. Message, please. Riding the cosmic wave. So I am getting that for some of you, um, things are coming at you left and right. And right now, stuff is happening where you are feeling a little bit overwhelmed, you know, maybe uh, in your life right now. And you're sort of, um, the message is for you guys to just, you need to ride it out. It's going to be over, but you need to just ride it out and not resist anything that's happening right now because anything that's happening right now is ultimately bringing you what you've been wanting, okay? So sometimes it's in a, in a, in a way or in a form that we're not liking very much or we're finding it a little bit difficult, but ultimately it is going to bring you to where you want to be and we're telling you to just ride it out, ride the cosmic wave. So I am going to still go into the book and read whatever message is there for you. This oracle brings a message. Um, there is there's a time to work hard and a time to allow the fruits of one's labor to manifest, right? This is what, this is what I, I was saying. When one may be carried by forces in, set in motion by the energy of life itself, you can let go and move further, reach further with less effort. Now is a time to give yourself permission to stop paddling and instead just ride the wave give in, let go, and be moved. And so not try to control any kind of outcome or just let go. Now you don't even need to do anything. Things are just going to happen um, for you, for your highest good, okay? Right now, things are happening for you right now, okay? So that's the message. Let's see what's going on. Messages for the collective, please. Twin flame soulmate love. The star. So we do have Aquarius energy. The devil. Magician. Wow, all major arcana, you guys. Things are happening like at a, um, and we have the King of Pentacles. Things are happening at a larger scale for you at a more, um, it is longer. It's a longer process, but things are happening. So we do have um, 
um, someone who is uh, feeling quite uh, at peace, uh, feeling very, uh, well, at peace when they're around you, uh, they're feeling like this, like your their dream come true. Um, and they do have uh, this thing where they're, um, they start to have doubt. They start to have like, um, your person could start to have doubt about their own feelings, about feeling like this, this can't be, you know, that kind of doubt, you know, like, how can this person want to be with me? Or why is it that I want to be with this person so much? Um, we have this. And so this is what keeps your person from really feeling this so much. Okay. It's, um, it's anything else, uh, addictions, um, habits, uh, people even it's it's all of the uh all of the ties that bind this person okay they this person has ties that bind him or her um where it's blocking them could be blocking them from this connection in the past it could have been like that as I see it right now, things may have been changing. Your person is starting to feel a little bit more confident, have a little bit more resources at hand. Your person may be uh, um, asking about you, asking about this connection, asking friends, talking with family and friends about this, trying to get as much support and maybe just asking for advice like what is this and what do I do now and your person is really feeling way more stable okay um, we're talking about stable in their 3d about about uh, just where they're at not necessarily about money but it could be about career it could be about your person's wanting to start up a, a business if we here we have the king of pentacles virgo capricorn taurus energy some of you i get your you're dealing you may be dealing with a capricorn with the devil card and with this earth energy some of you may be dealing with a capricorn or someone with capricorn in their chart um, so this person may be a boss already and or maybe someone who owns their own business um, and they're feeling much more ready to start something where in the past they were really like stuck in their heads and bound to like really old ways of thinking and just like the impossibility of it all but they are very attracted to you they feel bound to you in a way as well. If it's been a while, if it's been a long time, this connection, your person is really like, they cannot deny it anymore that there is something there. There is something there for you guys. I'm going to take my mystic moon. <clears throat> these readings are not going to be long today as I am a bit late and I wanted to get these out to you today for the full moon. And for the weekend, let's see what's going on with my Mystic Moon Oracle deck. Yeah. <sighs> let's see what's going on. Twin Flame. So if some of you wanted confirmation, is this my person? Is this my twin flame or soulmate? And that's, that's confirmation right there. Ascending. This relationship, this connection is really moving forward, by the way. It's really moving forward fast. It's, it's getting there now. Your person has awakened. Offer. An offer is coming. A date, maybe. Something like that. Um, an offer of a truth possibly and we have a fresh start so an offer of a fresh start with you possibly on the horizon for many of you guys there are many <clears throat> of you coming into union right now with your twin flame or with your soulmate and <clears throat> things are going to start like 
I'm telling you, like this is happening very soon. Your person is just getting their ducks in order. I feel like with the magician here, they are just just making sure with you, either with you by communicating with you, making sure that they're going the right way or they're asking friends, possibly. Uh, you will be receiving communication in the form of an offer of uh, maybe a, having a drink or something or just talking. This is coming. It's there in the cards, you guys. Uh, no. I'm going to take one of these. Let's see. What else? Another message for the collective, please. This one. It's the one. It's the one. TikTok. So it is a matter of time. It's only a matter of time until this happens. Your person feels like they are running out of time in this connection because it's been so long and things have been dragging out for so long. So there is a kind of a pressure to do something, okay? But also to tell you to trust in divine timing, ride this wave, just let things go. Let things go and live your life right now, okay? Time is running out. Time has so many meanings. It's crazy, especially now with everything that's going on. I really do feel like the events that are happening will culminate to something really rather significant for the whole planet. <laughs> I think I feel like there's a huge shift with everybody. And so we're talking about divine timing here. Trust in it. I'm going to pull out one last message from your person to see what your person would like for you to know or what would they like to tell you if they could right now. Oh, and I think I will pull out a one of my musical oracle cards for you as well. As my friend Danielle sent them to me. I use them a lot. Okay, let's see what your person would like for you to know. This connection will never fade. I will always love you. So this person is coming to that conclusion. As I said, your person is thinking, wow, you know, what is this? Why won't this go away? Why won't this person just disappear from my mind? And here we go. <laughs> yeah. Okay. One last card. Let me take one of these for you. One last message for the collective, please. To close out this reading. Oh, no, 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 that's, whoa. All right. I'll take them both. We've got Bjork, one of my favorites. I love Bjork. Devour life whole. Organize an orgy with the sky and the sea. Optimism is energy. Wow, so this is like, ride the wave, even the colors really. Uh, ride the wave, you know, just have fun. Have fun right now. And then we have Beyonce. Beyonce. Um, confidence can be, most power, uh, can be the most powerful aphrodisiac. Be both everywhere and nowhere at once. When someone sings from the heart, don't go tone deaf. Your person is really gaining a lot of confidence, way more than they have before. I'm getting this person is really, really um, ready. There's a part of them that's really ready. They're like, okay, this is enough. I'm not going to continue just pretending like this isn't happening so your person has decided they really want to devour life whole your person hasn't really been living much okay 
um, they've been um, healing. You know, they feel like they've been just waiting for life to happen. But now they're taking the bull by the horns and they are making life happen for them. It's just rather beautiful. Rather beautiful. Okay, you guys. So that's all the messages I have for you guys for the weekend. I want to wish you a great one. Happy full moon eclipse. <laughs> okay. And um, yeah, I will talk to you soon. Have a great day. Bye-bye.